guys? Welcome back, Drip Farm fam, to a, another video um, brought to you by Drip and Farm for Poverty, where our vision and mission on this channel is to help you reach financial freedom and therefore help you empower the impoverished by finding that financial freedom through crypto assets and DeFi. If you like that mission, resonate with the vision, smash that subscribe button so you don't miss another video. And then this one, I'm going to be talking about what literally just happened a couple hours ago. I'm way on the other side of the globe, so this happened in the U.S., but Stunner Breezy, I know he is a U.S. Uh, person based, and this is primarily a U.S. based system. Uh, Forex definitely has a U.S. accent as well, and if you look at the number of people in Drip, they're all from the U.S. mostly. But long story short, I'm going to play this video for you guys that shows what happened uh, to his account. So Stunner Breezy is the largest whale in the Drip ecosystem. I did a video on this. Maybe I'll try to attach it somewhere up here um, in the uh, the video. Um, but he did a video on this already, or I did a video on this, and he's been in since the beginning of Drip. Forex actually reached out to him and got him, told him he was going to do this um, Drip account. And I guess they were in projects before, so he asked him as a whale would he be willing to put up some money. And you can reach it, uh, go back to his videos and listen to it. And he talks about, yeah, he put up uh, X amount and then he put in 100,000, I think, in the beginning. And then as Drip crashed, he continued to hydrate and put in more money. Uh, I think it was 50,000. And then he put in up to another 50,000 when it was down to three to four dollars. But anyway, I'm going to play this video and show you what is happening for him. So you see, he currently has 200, 200 Drip available. I'm going to speed this up. I didn't put the audio on because there's no need. But what you'll find is this actually starts to depreciate. So the contract kicks in and actually starts to drop his balance. There it goes. It was 206. Now it's already 200.74. I'm going to speed this up even more. It'll get down to 192. Let's go skip a bit. It's 200.84. Now he's talking about the markets and how those are trading. And he's talking about how they're currently up and to the right. So the global macro markets, because they're devalued in uh, dollar, are showing that things are up, even though if you actually do your research, it's because of inflation that these markets are up. And then boom, now he's down to 182. So he wasn't aware of this in the video when this shocks him. He's like, man, I just had 200. Why am I at 182 now? He refreshes and um, it stays there. It's because the contract kicked in and said, oh, we can't give him this total amount this is the max payout he can get to make it reach the 100,000 max payout. So literally what he does is he claims this amount. So he's over here, he's claiming, confirm, and confirm successful, he's at the 100K. So what does that mean for the price of drip, guys, that now that this wallet has been kicked out? Don't get it twisted, he has other wallets, he's already started on them. Um, I don't know how many thousands. I think when I looked at it about a month ago, it had 15,000. But he said he's going to take this 2,000. He's not going to dump it on the system. He's going to put it back into the system. So he said he's never, ever sold more than 100 drip. He's only sold 77 or less. So he's talking about being a responsible whale. And that's another thing that makes this ecosystem sustainable is having the whales actually, not just the whale tax, but actually be responsible, like he said, so this makes this stay longer because he's getting hit with these taxes. Then he's going to take this 2000 and put it into his other account. That's going to get to that whale tax protocol or tier as well. And what that means is that as these other accounts that we see here, um, they start to reach that max payout, they're going to start to be pulled out, meaning that it in improves not only the token price, but the sustainability of drip. So there's a couple accounts in here um, that Forex mentions that will start to um, be pulled out of the system because there's people that have been hitting that hydro or claim button. This doesn't go all the way back for some odd reason. Coin market cap stops it at August, but we know this came in in April. So Stunner Breezy is already at max payout due to the amount that he put in. So even though the platform came online in April, He's already maxed out a month early. So I think the platform came online April 22nd is what he said. So Stunner Breezy is literally um, 50 some odd days ahead of schedule because he put in more into the system. Well, there are going to be other people who were just hitting the claim button 
and that will put them at the 365% max payout. So that means people around this area, especially starting in um, May, June, July, August timeframe, that saw the price of drip dropping and they were just like, oh, I'm gonna get my money out. So they were hitting claim. That means they're gonna start falling out of the system in addition to the people that have these higher wallet amounts because that's the quickest way to max out your payout is hydrating and putting more capital in because there's a maximum, remember, of 100,000 drip tokens. So if we uh, pull this up, let me pull up the drive for the wallet that I have, or the calculator, I should say, just to show you what can happen and how quickly it can take place. Um, let me find the drip calculator because we don't know where these guys will be, but we know that if you play the strategy with a lower amount of capital, you can um, get there slower. So it'll actually take like five years. But let's just say you had one wallet and the price of drip, like when Stunner Breezy you got in was around $5. Oh, come on, geez, it takes so long to uh, load whenever you're doing something. So starting deposit, split between drip, so he could have brought, let me pull up the calculator. So let's say 100,000 divided by five. So he could have bought 20,000 drip. If he had to put that in. I just wanna show you how long this would take to pay out. So right now, if you had one drip, you could get all the way to five years. If we do this, you'll see how quickly you reach max payout of 100,000 drip. So it's still calculating up here. Yeah. It's calculating, calculating. Look at that, it just chopped off <laughs> four years that this contract, and that's if this is $5, it doesn't matter, but that's just to say he had 20,000 tokens. So his wallet, when you start to look at the actual wallet here, um, and this is doing an alternating claim hydrate strategy, um, this is the whale tier. So it starts reading a whale tier before it even gets to six months. And then by the maximum payout, so here we are, max payout, 340, boom. At just over a year, it reaches max payout, 365 days. So you don't get any of this drip, you're done. And this was alternating, hydrating, claiming, hydrating, claiming. So um, that just shows you the power of the system. So if, if someone were to hydrate the entire time, they would reach uh, that payout even a little slower, I think, but it doesn't change because remember it's capped. So everybody gets the same total amount of drip. Nothing changes. So when you get there is dependent on your strategy, how much you put in, how often you hydrate, how often you, um, pull out. So this one takes uh, just over, oh, still, still calculating. Yep, so uh, looks like it comes still one year. So let's see where the exact date is. So they hydrated all the way until they hit maximum 100,000 tokens. Oh, it's already there. It's forcing them to hydrate here. Yep, 27, so that's it. 20, remember 27.3 is the maximum number of tokens. So if you hydrate and you started with 20 grand, you're only gonna get 35 days. <laughs> so at least by hydrating and claiming, you draw it out, but regardless, you get the same payout. So again, this is, this is really bullish for the entire ecosystem, because as I showed you guys, there are tons of wallets that will start to max out. So that's gonna, of course, affect the price of drip in the short term, but long term, the bulk of the people are back here. And these guys have learned what these guys have already done, so a lot of people I know are playing the long game where like they've done like me, where they've created multiple wallets, where they're doing an alternating every other week, one hydrate or something like that. They're trying to draw this out because no matter what, 27.3 thousand is the maximum uh, um, allocation that you're trying to get to regarding the 100,000 tokens because um, that's where it maxes out. So everybody's wallet will get to 100,000 tokens if they play the long game. 
So this is the number of deposits that will get you there because 27.3 thousand or 0.5 or whatever it is times 365, which is the maximum payout percent, gives you that. And the reason that comes up, just if you're looking for that calculation, it's uh, 100,000 because that's the maximum drip divided by 365. There's your 27,395. Uh, so somewhere between these two is where you cap out. So anyway, the point being, guys, this is extremely bullish for the platform, and I will put this video in the link so that you can check it out yourself. Forex has already talked about it as well. Um, so getting the whales out of the system so that they can't dump tokens is good, and the whales seeing how much this has benefited them um, is also bullish for the system. So again, if he, Stunner Breezy, on average, will just say his 100,000 tokens was averaging $50 a piece, he's made well over $5 million. Because remember, he bought in when it was like 30, then it dropped down to three, then it shot all the way up to 160. I'm sure he took out some there around that time. Now it's around 80. So if you do the math, let's just say 50 to 40, it doesn't matter. He has made his money back, guaranteed. I think the maximum he put in was 100 grand. So um, this is really, really good. Just shows you the strength of the platform. And uh, I'll be doing another video about the AMA because later on today, I think uh, a couple hours, they will be launching the piggy bank. And there's been some, um, some already some videos and some uh, live stream from Forex. But he talked about Stunner Breeze specifically because he is the first wallet to graduate the system, so to speak. And the system you saw, it automatically basically uh, locked his account at that payout. So that is super, super exciting and helps us see the uh, strength of the protocol and know what to expect for the future. And then again, all of us just now getting in, like myself got in uh, just earlier in February, so not even one month in, lets me know that this is a sustainable protocol. Like even though this guy put in 100 grand, he's picking out one, 5 million, price of drip is still down the exact same percent that uh, Bitcoin and ETH and the rest of the market is correcting. So uh, once these announcements come out for the new partnerships and these whales get out, like long term, the, the platform is sustainable because of the tax system. So this is proof right here. No other platform is doing this. This guy got in and he's been kicked out in less than a year. And he's already created another wallet because he knows how integral this is to building financial freedom. So. Do that with what you will. Um, I'm bullish on it, and that just even further incentivizes me to share this message and help you guys understand what's going on. So until next time, guys, lift daily and achieve your impossible. We'll see you in another video.